Good morning, my family. Here we have some fresh update on Kayla and Dodie's situation. So please be attentive as her mother outlined the progress she has seen so far. And um, remember, if you're new to the channel, if it is your first time over here, please I'm asking you to subscribe. Plus, click the notification bell and while doing so, select option all. So that way, you'll be first in line to be notified about each and every activities on our channel. And also remember to give this video a like for YouTube algorithm. Blessings and more beatitude. Buck at it. Good night, Facebook family, friends of Kaylan. I wasn't going to do a live until tomorrow. Guys, you can stop commenting on that post right now. Let me put this on silent. Mm. All right, there you go. I have learned. Um, there seems to be an argument on my page right now for some reason. Um, I'll address that first before I go into talking about my beautiful child. Um, hi guys, hi Khadija, hi Tamara, Tamara, I love you, girl. Sean, Inis, good night. Good night, guys. Hi, sis. Hi, Divine Ardine Stewart. That's my sister right there. Guys, Kaylin have a lot of aunties. And she has now gained a lot more. Um, I can't express how grateful and blessed we are. Even though people might think... Um, that this is a very difficult time. Yes, I do agree it's a difficult time. But, um, you know, in the midst of a storm, you know, there, there will be calm. You know, after every storm, there must be a calm. Um, we are forever grateful for the love, the support, the kindness that you guys have been showing us. Um, you know, let me snap quickly. No, I won't be long. I won't take up your guys' time. Mother, I'm right beside you. Why would you even go on the live? You see, I'm not the only phone idiot in a... This is my mother now going on the live. <laughs> right beside me. Oh, my Lord. Um, I will repeat this again. There's only one GoFundMe page. It's organized by Angela May Kelly. One GoFundMe. There is a fundraiser, a Facebook fundraiser that is approved by me. I will say this for the last time because apparently per persons aren't listening when I speak and they're causing a lot of problems for us. Because they, they had that page shut down and we got it up back and then they're st still trying to get it shut down again. Tammy Faye is the organizer of the Facebook fundraiser. Tammy Faye is associated with Auntie Donna's program. People, Tammy Faye is doing the fundraiser, the Facebook fundraiser for Kayla and Dowdy. There's only one Facebook fundraiser and it's done by Tammy Faye. If I don't say otherwise, then there's not another one. I noticed there are, I had to report about four Kale and Dowdy pages on Instagram yesterday. People making fake pages. I will post Kaylan's right Instagram page so you guys can know which page it belongs to Kaylan. There's only one Kaylan page right she had an old one that she forgot the password for i know that page i'll still post it and the one that she's currently using i'll post that one so you guys can see so any other face um instagram page that you guys see in regards to kayla and dowdy report it please but i will let you guys know shortly um which one when i'm finished the live i'll post it remember guys tammy Faye is doing a facebook fundraiser Tammy Faye is from Auntie Donna's program. People, please show that page a lot of love and support. Because there's a huge argument. This lady says she needs a voice note to be convinced that it's my page. I posted it. So if you, if you see it on my page, then how are you not convinced? There's only one Venetia Buckley in this entire world. You can never find another me. 
I'm the only one in this entire world with that name and spelt that way. All right, guys. Um, back to Kaylan. Kaylan is. Oh, Kaylan is. She's not doing badly. She's doing. She's moving forward. I am pleased. Um, you know. Yes, we are not out of the woods. We are not where we want to be. We are not. You know, as yet. But we're giving God thanks for the little blessings that we do have. She's still um, still on the ventilator, still not breathing on her own. We are trusting God for a miracle where her breathing is concerned. Um, yeah, we're, 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 we're trusting God for a miracle where that is concerned. Um, however, she is responsive. Um, she opens her eyes just the same when I enter the room and I call her name. She's now looking at me. She can see me. Yes, her eyes are dilating. So that's a plus for us as well. Um, you know, she's slowly, um, a bit more alert. So, you know, um, we're heading in the right direction. So some, some, some form of healing is happening there and we are, Trust me, you guys might think it's it's not that big, but when you go into a hospital room and you see your child just laying there, not moving, not responding, not doing anything, not breathing, unconscious, she can't recognize you, she can't recognize anybody, she can't focus, she can't look at you. It's heartbreaking. So the minute I saw her looking and I saw that she looked, Hey, I'm through the roof. I jumped and I behaved like an idiot in that hospital. And the nurses laughed at me. But hey, I am, um, you know, I'm forever grateful. Um, yes, so and Walker, God is great. God is awesome. God is awesome. He is, you know. And, you know, I have been telling her about you guys. You know, how much you guys been showing her love. Because she can hear me. She can hear me. Um, I, I've been telling her about the support. I tell, I, I talk to her every day. I tell her what's going on in this, in, this, in this world around her. And how much you guys are outpouring. You know, the concerns and the love and everything. Yeah, said I wasn't going to be long because <laughs> it's after 10 and I know everybody wants to go to bed. I you know, yes, I'm trusting the process because, you know, it's not our time. It's God's timing and we have to let him work. We have to trust God and put all our faith in God and know that we have to let him do what is best because God knows best. Not even, you know, he gives doctors wisdom and skill to do what they you know they learn and memory to work from but he's he's the big man god is the big man he's the healer the doctor you know he's the nurse he's 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 everything right so and and as long as we trust god and we put all our faith in him he will deliver us and then come on the whole world is praying so God must, his, his ears are ringing with Kaylan's name. So, you know, I believe he's answering our prayers. I believe he is, he's listening, you know, because even babies are praying, kids are praying. Can you believe I get calls from 10-year-olds and 8-year-old children saying, Mommy, we love you, be strong, and we're praying for Kaylan. My mommy is praying for Kaylan, you know. I'm Kaylan, mommy. And I'm like, God bless you, mommy. You know? <laughs> yes, her breakthrough is coming, Toya. So her, her breakthrough is coming. It's, we, we are claiming it. We are claiming that bare breakthrough. You know? Um, George Shannon, I'll go and check for that message. I'll go and check for that message. Um, yes, God is keeping me. God is keeping me. Um, I know if I didn't decide honestly if i didn't decide to say put everything in god's hands and throw it all on his steps and lay my life at his feet 
then I'd probably be walking naked on the street, eating out of a garbage bin. So, because that's where I was here. I felt like I was gone ahead. That's the direction I felt like I was going. And God kept me. He kept me. He kept me. And he has been keeping me. And yes, Team, T team, team Kaelan. <laughs> I like that. Um, You know? was going to do um the update tomorrow as i posted before but because there was an argument on the page over tammy Faye's fundraiser i said let me go live and address it quickly before anybody shuts down that page again moneygram has blocked me i have not received any money from moneygram at all not even a red cent and uh, they are allegating that allegation is that um when the person that sent um some money to me for kaylan they told the individual that, um, oh, I'm doing illegal activities. So the person said, how can she be doing illegal activity when this woman's child is in a hospital in ICU unconscious and needs the help and other people are reaching out to help her? And, you know, they could not give a reason why. I'll be contacting them anyway. But, you know, come on, you know. I don't I don't have time to protest. I don't have I can't I don't have time to be focusing on those things. Right? I can't shift my focus from God and prayer to address every little thing that is going wrong elsewhere because I have to give Kaylan my all at the moment and that is where my focus is. Um so if Monogram thinks that they have a problem with me collecting their money there then I'll just have to take business elsewhere because they're not the only remittance service in this country. Um, you know, as you know, the the Kaylan's cash app is up. Pound sign justice for Kaylan. Um, the GoFundMe is still up. Um, it's organized by Angela May Kelly. That's my sister, blood sister. Yes, my sister. My big sister. Love you, Angie. Um, Chavel um, Car Clark is uh, the organizer for the Cash App. That's my sister as well. My baby sister. Right. Love you, Shav. So you guys and Tammy Faye, who has been a blessing to us so far. Um, you know, those those entities are open. The bank accounts are still open. Um, and I will give a post, I will post the account numbers again for those who want to do, do that Jane account and CB account. Um, you know, the journey will, will, it's a long journey ahead. Um, yes, it's an expensive journey. Um, yes, yes, it will, you know, but you know, we're not worried about it cause we're trusting God. Right. And we all, you know if we work together we can get it use zoom um i've never used zoom before but i can look into zoom okay i see a lot of people saying use zoom right so you know um can angie angie can you pin the cash app for me i don't know how because i don't know my phone idiot somebody pin the cash app for me please there's some persons asking to pin the cash app right um i don't know people i don't know how to pin anything <laughs> i don't know how to pin anything i just learned how to do live so yes she will be okay kaylan will be okay yes um so you know i just want to say thank you i won't be long i'm gonna go I just want to say thank you, big thank you. Yes, yes, I can receive money from Western Union, but they say that I can't receive. I think I had about eight transactions already this month, and they said I can't receive any more until next month. So, yes, it's a very limited amount of money you can collect. But um, what I'll do, I'll post. I'll, I'll anybody wants who wants to. To use Western Union, I can give my mother's name and she can do some collecting or my other sister that is her name and she can collect as well for me. Um, 
Guys, there is Tammy. There is Tammy Faye. She's in the comments. That's the beautiful lady that is organizing the fundraiser, the Facebook fundraiser. People stop getting it confused. A GoFundMe is different from a Facebook fundraiser. Right? It's two different, two different things. So thank you again, guys. Thank you for the support. Kaylan is slowly but surely coming on. She will be with us. I'm praying before the holidays. Um, anybody knows where I can get a very good camera and what I don't know anything about cameras, but Kaylan had two wish lists for, for this holiday. She said she wanted a life size teddy bear and a camera. She takes good pictures. She loves photography as well. And she took a lot of my nice pictures. I don't want to post them, but yes, yeah, she's very good at photography. And she said she wanted a camera for her Christmas. And I'm, and I'm going to try and buy that camera. But I don't know what. Anybody can give me any tips on good cameras. What a good camera is. And what um, brand camera I should be looking at. Because I need the help. Because I'll go on Insta, um, you Google it and just pick foolishness. So anybody who is into photography who can give me a little tips on what a good camera camera is i would appreciate that tip so i can know which direction to go so and where i can find a life-size teddy bear to put on her bed because she said she wanted that so that's her two things that i she said she wanted for a christmas when i asked her that's before her the the incident she said she wanted those two things so yeah kaylan don't ask for much she's not a fussy child and that's why i love her so much if me, i've met her in the truth if a bird and butter I'm have kale and eat it on garbage. She's not a little girl with a you can do nothing for red or yeah. Or make she crave off of nothing. You understand? Kale and not stay so. I may tell people say, so, oh me grow my picnic them. Anything me give them, them eat it and got them bed and them happy. Them not make nothing bad of them. I mean, grow them that way. They sometimes coffee, sometimes tea. Mothers, they have to teach your children that sometimes they have to do with less and be content. Because I grew up on nothing. We were poor. We grew up on little to nothing. That's why I try so hard to make sure that my kids get the best of everything that I can give them. But at the same time, I make them know, say, we may have it will not be satisfied with so yes so camera please give me the tips on the camera and they and i don't know there's i know there's some focus business and zoom business on the cameras and some the specs yes that's what i need the specs on the camera the specs on the camera so I need a, a good camera for her and I need a life-size teddy bear. Please point me in the right directions where I can go and source these two items because she's going to get them for this Christmas. Yes. So again, aunties, uncles, cousins, nieces and nephews of Kayla and Dodie, I thank you all for the support and the love. You guys have been overwhelming. I didn't expect it to be like this. But you know what? I am happy because I don't feel alone. The, you know, you know, sometimes you go through things and you feel alone. It makes you go and sink into a dark place. And, you know, you feel like the world is against you. Um, honestly, I don't feel that way this time. I've been through a lot in my life and I'm, I don't feel that way right now. Because you guys are, have my back. You guys have Kaylan's back. You know, and you guys are supporting us in every way, mentally, physically, financially. We do appreciate every bit of support. The prayers are going up. And she, Kaylan loves purple. Someone is asking about, she's a purple girl. She loves lavender purple. Or what? How her dad is doing. Oh, he's taking it really hard. He comes to the hospital as well. Um, her father, someone is asking about Kaylan's father. Um, yeah. You know, he visits. He visits. So it's not as if he's not showing up in this time. He is showing up. Because, you know, it's a difficult time for both sides of the family. 
even though he's on one side and I'm on one side, but his family is showing up and he's showing up. So, you know, kudos to them as well for being supportive. Yes, Kellen is going to be okay, everybody. So we just have to just keep praying. Remember, remember, who can fast, fast? Who can pray, pray? Who can pray, cry? Just call her name to God because we need these lungs. The lungs have to start working. She's still depending on the machine 100% for breathing. And that is the, you know, that is, that is where we're at now. We need her lungs to chip in. So, have a great night, everybody. God bless you all. I wish you all the prosperity there is in this world. I wish God pour out him never-ending blessings on each and every one of you. May your store baskets never go empty. May he build a fence of protection around you and your families, you know, and strengthen each and every one of you so that you can go through your rough times, you know, like champions. So, Thank you, guys. Have a great night.